Garrett's place he's renting right now because he got promoted and he had to move to be closer to work. The place he's renting right now is like literally grandma's house. It is old fashioned in like the best way possible. It feels really cozy. Super grandma, but it's honestly funny. He has a coin operated laundry machine. I just think it's hilarious. And they're charging $2.50. That's not really cool of grandma. That is inflation right there. Laundry should be like 50 cents if I'm dropped into a place that looks like this. Anyway, he's at work. I am working from home today. Oh, fuck. Splash zone. When he's back slash this weekend, we're gonna explore the new town he's moved to because it has some cool spots, it seems like. My throat is a bit scratchy this morning. And I used to get like really, really bad um, sore throats. And I had a really bad sore throat in first year and I was absolutely miserable. It was like swallowing glass. And I remember out of desperation, I Googled quick ways to get over a sore throat. Just like shot in the dark, didn't actually think it, it would tell me anything meaningful. And this YouTube video came up and it was talking about pressure points on the back of your neck. And this guy basically demonstrated that you feel where your sore throat is in the front. Let's say you feel it, like when you swallow, it hurts here. You trace that to the back of your neck. You pinch the back of your neck where, just like that, like the tender parts of the back of your neck where it hurts. And you do that for like a minute, two minutes. Time yourself, just pinching it. When you let go, he's like, it's gonna feel clear. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna try it. I did it. I had the worst scratchy th throat in my entire life and I did it and my throat was clear. Like I could swallow clearly and it was so mind blowing. I called my mom, I called my friends, I called everyone that would listen of like, do this if you have a sore throat, it fixes it. And ever since then, like when I start squeezing the back of my neck when I feel like I have a sore throat, I feel like I've had less sore throats kind of like nips it in the bud early. You will have to continue to do it because um, it will work for like a little bit and then you'll feel your sore throat coming back. So you have to keep pinching, but it's crazy what pressure points do. Anyway, not sure how I got down that tangent, but that was like an aha moment that changed my life. If you have a sore throat and you're watching this, give it a try. It is magical. So I was a little social butterfly this weekend and I saw two separate sets of friends. I know, super I crazy, but <laughs> I went out for my friend's birthday. We went out for some drinks in the city, which was really fun. And then the next day I went up north to visit my university friends and we had a really 
fun dance party. We sang, we danced, um, we had a wine night. Oh! I can't do it though. <laughs> None of us are super into the tarot cards, but my friend knows how to read them because they're just kind of fun to do. So she read our cards and I got the fool, which <laughs> explains a lot. So the fool, it's intoxication, frenzy. Wait, is this in the past or is this now? No, this is like how you see yourself and your like how, what attitudes you bring to your so bring to. I told you I'd be the fool. So she's your job again. <laughs> I told you everyone loves the fool. And then we ended it with watching what a girl wants. It was really fun, very wholesome night.